Let's suppose utility is given by the square root of x times y. To find the marginal utility of x, we'll take the derivative of utility with respect to x, and to find the marginal utility for good y, we'll take the derivative of utility with respect to y. Now notice these are partial derivatives because we've got more than one good. So I need to rewrite my functional form as x to the one-half times y to the one-half because I can't take a derivative of a radical symbol. I have to first convert it into an exponent. Well, taking the derivative of utility with respect to x, that one-half, which is the exponent on x, comes down in front. The exponent on x gets reduced by one, and y to the one-half remains. I can do some simplification. I'm going to convert that one-half into a decimal, 0.5. Combining the one-half minus one, which is the exponent on x, I get negative 0.5, and y, its exponent, is also 0.5. When I take the marginal utility of y, which is the first derivative of utility, with respect to y, it's symmetric in this case, right? So the exponent on y, the one-half, comes down in front. x to the one-half stays as it is. And then y, we have its exponent reduced by 1. So our marginal utility of good y is 0.5 times x to the 0.5, y to the negative 0.5.